In this video, we will look into the process of configuring parcel packing for WooCommerce UPS shipping. Access the Easy Post plugin settings through WooCommerce, Settings, Shipping, Easy Post, and click the Packaging tab. Here you will find three options. Pack items individually. In this option, each item will be individually packed in separate boxes. The total shipping cost of an order will be calculated by adding the shipping cost of each item. Pack into boxes with weight and dimensions. In this scenario, you will be able to define custom box sizes to pack items. You can define multiple boxes based on the weight and dimensions of your products. The plugin will automatically choose the best box for a particular order based on what you have already defined. Pack items based on weight. Weight-based packing method will be useful when you want to pack items based only on their weight and not dimensions. You can use this method in several scenarios, where you need to pack materials in bulk purely based on weight. Here you can define a box maximum weight, which will be the maximum weight that will be packed into one box. Let us take a look at example scenarios for each of these options. Suppose a customer is purchasing 3 units each of the following products. Beanie, weight 0.5 pounds or 8 ounces. Hoodie with zipper, weight 1 pound or 16 ounces. Hoodie with logo, weight 1.5 pounds or 24 ounces. The length bread, and height for all three products are set at 2. Let's look at the settings and outcomes for each of these parcel packing methods. You simply have to choose this option under the parcel packing settings. On the cart page, shipping rates will be displayed considering a separate package for each item. When you receive an order, you can generate the packages from the order detail page. For each item in the order, there will be a separate package. In this example, there are total 9 items, and hence 9 packages are created. When you choose the second option, a new field will be displayed, where you can enter the box dimensions. You will be able to enter both outer and inner dimensions here. The outer dimensions are of the box, while inner dimensions define the product. Include the weight of the box, if that is considerable. You can also specify the maximum weight allowed in a particular box, so that packing will consider the weight of the product as well. This would mean that both dimensions and weight of a product will be considered when an order is automatically assigned a custom box. We have created three custom boxes for this example. Now, on the cart page, the rates are displayed based on the weight and dimensions of the items. After you receive the order, when you generate shipment, you can see all items in the order are packed into a single box. When you choose this option, you can specify a maximum weight for the box, and also specify the way items will be packed inside the box. The options for packing are Pack heavier items first, in this option, heavier items will be packed first, followed by the lighter items, if an order has multiple products with varied weights. Pack lighter items first, in this scenario, lighter items will be packed first followed by heavier items. Pack purely divided by weight, here items will be packed purely divided by the total weight of the order. In this example, we are keeping a box maximum weight of 6 pounds, and choosing pack lighter items first. The cart page will display rates based on the weight of the items. Now on the order detail page, you can see the boxes are defined based on weight. Here you can see two packages are generated based on the maximum weight per box as well as the chosen packing process. In this case, the lighter items are packed first. So the order will be beanie, hoodie with zipper and then hoodie with logo. In the first box, 3 units each of beanie, 3 times 8 ounces, and hoodie with zipper, 3 times 16 ounces, are packed, along with 1 unit of hoodie with logo, 1 times 24 ounces. The maximum capacity of the box is reached, 6 pounds or 96 ounces. Now the remaining 2 units of hoodie with logo will be packed in another box, 2 times 24 ounces. Once the packages are created based on the parcel packing settings, you can generate the shipment label and print them. Check out the product page to understand all the features of the plugin. You can find more details on plugin configuration in the documentation. If you need any help, do not hesitate to contact our support team. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more similar videos.